Hi there guys, my name is Chris, welcome back. Today we're going to be taking a look at some work that's actually done by a British company for a change, it makes a nice change. Um, we've got some items here that have been hydro dipped by Camo Lab uh, here in the UK, like I say. Um, obviously some weapon accessories, got them dipped in the multicam, so we're going to take a little look at the quality of the workmanship and how it's done. Okay, so as you can see here, we've got three items that have uh, been dipped in the, the multicam film. Got the BCM gunfighter grip, got a CTR stock from Magpul Industries, and we've got the Gen 2 SS series free float uh, handguard tube from Midwest Industries. Now we'll start off, I think, with the rail. That's quite a good, it's a good example to show. Now overall, guys, I've been really impressed with the standard of the work I've seen here from Camo Lab. Um, I've seen some examples of when hydro dip goes wrong and it looks really terrible. Um, but I'm happy with this stuff. It's gone on nice and thin. You can actually still make out the, uh, the T marking engravings on the wrist there. So it's looking pretty good. Um, a good one, obviously with the multicam film, you've actually got the word multicam in there. And that's uh, evident in a few places. But as you know, it's the actual real stuff. And uh, also it's sort of a good indicator because it's got that sharp lines. It's a, it's a very precise, a small detail. If the work was done to a bad standard, it's not going to look good. So it's quite a little useful uh, sort of judging, deciding factor there. The finish is extremely smooth. It's almost a little bit too smooth. This, um, you know, th this isn't a reflection on Camo Lab. This is just how, how uh, things go with hydro dipping. It's extremely smooth. Um, so you may be going to want to, if you get like a handguard done in something like this, you might want to look at some rail panels. But as you can see, the, the actual multicam pattern is represented really well. Um, there's very few, I mean, there's tiny little specks where you can see the undercoat, but it's very minor. There's, and there's not a lot at all. A few tiny, tiny errors, but that is pretty much what you're going to get. Uh, there's, there's no real way around it when you're uh, doing a water transfer on these things. And moving on to the BCM grip. Again, very nice job. With the rail that was dipped in a, in one go, with the grip and the stock, this is they've had to have a, a two dip process. So one half, and then flip around to the other half. As you can see here, it's absolutely dead down the middle. Very precise. It's taken well to this texturized area, and on the serrations to the front strap there, the separate piece, the interfaces with the covers up the gap on the trigger guard. Patterns continued well on there good. Also done the actual grip plug. Pattern all continues nicely. It's not interrupted or anything like that. Overall just yeah really nice. Um, see the see this off the tan base coat under there. Obviously these parts were all of these were black originally so if a uh, hadn't had the the base coat that Camo Lab does, the multicam pattern wouldn't actually look very good. But the work that uh, Toby over there at Camo Lab does, he spends a lot of time on each piece, puts a lot of man hours in, a lot of time and effort, and uh, comes out with a good result. CTR stock is pretty impressive. Now I, I, this is exactly how I sent it to him. I stripped off the uh, you know the butt plate and all that sort of thing, and uh, actually what he's done is. Coming out this pin here to remove the friction lock lever, also removed the, uh, the locking lever and the, and the plunger for the standard adjustment. The pattern doesn't actually continue from the main body of the stock onto the lever. The pattern uh, is separate because these pieces have been dipped separately, which is exactly what you want if you just simply dipped this whole assembly as it was into the tank. Um, it wouldn't end up with very good results and you'd end up with sort of gaps up in, in these sort of areas and on the, the pivot pins, all that sort of stuff. But it's it come out extremely nicely. Again, a double dipping for this particular piece, dead straight down the center, exactly in the middle, very nicely done. Extremely good finish. You'll notice a little bit of a sheen, and um, this is because not only is there an undercoat beneath the 
water transferred film but there is a protective layer put on top by Camelab as well so you can have a nice hard wearing finish to it it's going to be way better than you know just straight up spray painting something this is going to last a lot longer than that you know it's not invincible but hydro dip uh, if it's done to a high standard like these parts are will last a pretty long time now you can get a whole range of different uh, camo patterns done over there at Camelab um, Toby's a really nice guy I've spoken to him a lot during the process of getting these parts done uh, he set a deadline, he got them done, uh, he actually delivered, got the parts back to me, they, were all, they had tons of wrapping and packaging all over them, delivered, special delivery by 1pm, which obviously isn't a cheap delivery service, so having a, having this sort of service available in the UK is really good, a couple of his business cards here, the website is excellent, like I say, Toby runs the, uh, runs the operation there at Camelab, top bloke, um, I'll definitely be having more stuff done. He's got the uh, the ATAX patterns available. There's a couple of his business cards here. ATAX AU is available. There's the website. Obviously, I'll put it in the description box as well. Contact details for Camo Lab. Uh, pricing and all the details of different patterns. Um, just shoot them an email, give them a ring, get in touch. You know, get some stuff done. Uh, he's got. Definitely the multicam and the ATAX available. I think he's got some cryptech. He's got more cryptech stuff coming in at the, you know, the time I've put this video, obviously. Uh, the work is to a great standard. Details of all the pricing and stuff on the website is very competitive, considering the amount of man hours goes into stripping, cleaning, uh, the base coat, the hydro dip, the top coat, all the prep work, all the work that goes into these. Very happy with the pricing. Uh, yeah, just great service guys. So check out camelab.co.uk uh, Thanks for watching. Appreciate all the thumbs up subscribers all that good stuff uh, More obviously content available on the Facebook check that out as well, and thanks for watching guys. See you next time